One of the most important skills a statistical analyst should get is creating and using dummy variables. Dummy variables are categorical variables that take only two values, coded with 0 and 1. They are used especially in regression models as predictors. In the first part of this video, we will explain how to convert a dichotomous variable in a dummy one. The second part will show how to convert a multinomial variable in a dummy variable. Let's go back to the employee data file. As you may remember, this file contains information about 474 employees in a United States bank. Let's study the gender variable. As you can notice, this variable is a binomial one, and it's a string variable. It's coded like this, male employees with M and female employees with F. If we wanted to use it in a regression model, we must absolutely convert it into a dummy variable. This can be made by simple recoding, as we showed in the previous lesson. One of these values will become zero, the other one will become one. The value that becomes zero is called reference value. We will choose the reference value depending on our goals. For example, let's suppose we want to prove that men have bigger salaries than women, on average. In this case, it is convenient for us to choose the F value, the women, the female employees, as the reference value. Now let's execute the recoding procedure. So the female employees will be coded with zero and the male employees will be coded with one. We go here in the transform menu, recode into different variables. The variable to recode is gender. The new variable will have the name, let's say, gender2. We press change to confirm the new name. And now we press the old and new values button to make the actual recording. So, as we said, the F value female becomes zero, is the reference value. Press add to confirm. And the M value, the male employees, becomes one. Add again. Press continue. And then OK. As you notice, the program added the gender2 variable here, and its values are, of course, 1 for male employees and 0 for female employees. So we have just recoded a variable to transform it into a dummy one. Well, for a multinomial variable, the things are a bit more complicated. A multinomial variable with n categories can be converted into n minus 1 dummy variables. For instance, if we have a variable with three categories, two dummy variables must be created. Now let's look a bit at this variable, jobcat, in the same file, employee data. Let's see how it's coded. Double click here and then here in the values column. Uh, the code 0 is for the missing values, but we don't have missing values here. 1 is for clerical employees, 2 is for custodial employees, and 3 is for managers. Now, let's convert it into two dummy variables, because it has three categories. First of all, we must select a reference category. Let it be 3, manager. So, for the other two categories, clerical and custodial, we must create our dummy variables. This table shows us how we will convert these new variables. So, the initial categories of our variable are clerical, custodial, manager, coded with 1, 2, 3, you remember. We have called these new variables suggestively is clear, is clerical, and is cost, is customer, is custodial, excuse me. So, the variable is clear will take the value 1 if the employee is clerical, and the value 0 if the employee is not clerical, is either custodial or manager. As for the variable is cost, it will take the one value if the, the employee is custodial, and the value 0 
if the employee is not custodial, is either clerical or manager. And we notice that for both variables, the reference category manager has the value zero. So we will have two recording procedures to run. One for the variable is clear and the other one for the variable is cost. Let's do that now. Again in the menu transform, recode into different variable. We'll press reset here. So the variable to be recorded is employment category. The first variable is of course is clear change. Now let's press all the new values. So the initial code one will be converted into one and the initial codes two and three will be converted into zero. So the initial coded code one is converted into one add and the all other values are converted into zero. Now we can press continue and OK. The new variable is clear was created here. Now let's create the second dummy variable is cost. Transform record into different variables. Press reset again. So employment category job cat will be converted into is cost, is custodial. Change to confirm the new name. All the new values. So here the old value 2, the old code 2 will be recorded into 1 and the old values 1 and 3 will be converted into 0. Very simple. So 2 will be converted into 1, add, and all the other values here will be converted into 0. Again add, continue and press OK to execute the procedure. The second dummy variable is cost was created here. So now you know how to convert a binomial and a multinomial variable into dummy variables. Thank you. See you in the next lesson.